go right into my charcoal get some on the brush like that and I'm just gonna start to mass in my subject I'll get some more charcoal and you can see that if I hold the brush on an angle like this I can get a sharper line I'm really just trying to mass in this general form and then I'm gonna go back and modify things at this stage I step back and I just try to look for uh, you know the biggest most obvious errors right now in plotting this drawing I want to hold off on putting the uh, first layer of fixative on until I really know that the drawings in the right place because my thinking is now that as soon as I spray this with that fixative it's gonna lock things in place I'll still be able to pull some of the charcoal out but it is gonna freeze up a lot of things so I want to make sure that I've got certain soft gradients already established. With this style application, I think it makes more sense to have it have that kind of fresh cut look to it. It's hard to get any tighter with the brush at this stage. You can still get a nice loose effect and still get some great uh, rendering going on. But yeah, if I really want to get into those details, it helps to have the charcoal. And this drawing is an example of that exact process. I started this drawing by using just the brush and the charcoal dust, like you saw me do in this video. And then when I got to a certain stage where I wanted to get more detailed, I just put down that layer of fixative and I went into the drawing with the B charcoal. Another alternative.